hit record, then she's like, I need to get a popsicle, not not beforehand. It's a pomegranate one. Really good. Pomegranate, okay. All right, that's different. Pomegranate popsicles. So actually, we'll start with Celine. We, we, we have not <laughs> seen her in a while. You can door pet food. Yeah. Pause. You can door dash pet food. Yeah. yeah. You, gotta you can door dash liquor. Pet food. Yeah. But pet food? Like, yeah. if you can door dash liquor, you don't Bro, think you should you be able to door dash pet food? You, it's you Amazon. Dash, you can Amazon pet food. So why can't you door dash pet food? What if, what if you need your pet food uh -oh. ASAP? Uh oh. Huh? You might need your you know, you might need your pet food ASAP. So that 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 makes sense. Okay, I guess uh, so. Right. Or you might be stranded. I can't go anywhere, but my pet is uh dying from starvation. Yeah, that's you know that's the thing. You, you like I said, the the pet might be there. But like, oh hey, I need this. But anyway, let's talk about Celine. We have not seen her in a bit. Where, where have you been? We missed you, you know. I've been working. I moved. Y'all know I moved from Nebraska to Dallas, so now I'm Dallas is home again. See, I didn't know that. Nice. I'll be there. I'll be there. Yeah, so we can I'll hang be out. Visiting. Um then um no, I've been working and just got a new vehicle. Yeah. Okay. Been momming a lot more because obviously, you know, in the we same don't care state about now, your kids, so it's Celine. not like a monthly thing. She's like, she's like, we don't care about your kids. People who just here to see you. Hey, but that's what's up. What else you been up to? I need more wine. I'm dead. Been trying to figure out why somebody in particular has been. Well, let me not start. With the shade, damn shade. Uh -oh. Why? <laughs> why? I mean, why do y'all think you know who is trying to make like me jealous or the, the other one jealous? No, we didn't. Oh, no. We're not talking about that right now. Whoa. That, 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 that is that is for a just chatting <laughs> Twitch stream that will just go and, and and we'll give everybody fake names and we'll discuss situations and I'll tell you Can't exactly you why. No. Y'all, so, I am like. Hey, so so right okay, now. so y'all wanna y'all wanna call them Billy, Sally? What the Billy fuck? and Sally. Billy, Sally, and yes. Jean. Sally. All right, here we go. So we got Billy, Billy Sally, Sally, and Jean. Sally and Jean. Let's go. Billy, Sally, Jean. No, we got Billy, Sally, and Jean. This is what I think, right? So really? you know, Bi see, <laughs> Billy was scared. like was all front end and trying to tell everybody that hey, you know what? Jean's my woman, and I have this like that, blah blah blah. This and Jean that too, but the whole time. Billy was trying to make Sally jealous because you know maybe maybe it's uh not to be mean but maybe maybe nine people out of ten think think that Gene is the one that 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 everybody wants right so maybe Billy was trying to just go go and get Sally and be like hey you know what get, get your feelers down or whatever like that too so he's falsely proclaim, proclaiming love for Gene but he's really trying to work with Sally. So, so, so Billy was Billy was using Billy was using Gene to get to Sally, and that's why there's this animosity between 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 Billy and Sally right now too. And that's the thing. And honestly, I honestly think that Billy and Sally are doing a little something something, and they're trying to pull a fast yeah. upon everybody. No, literally. I think, I think no. I think Billy, Billy and Sally, Billy Sally have went up. Billy and Sally. Billy and Sally went out Matt that one Sally. time. I think Billy and Sally went out more than that one time, and I think Billy and Sally are trying to, <laughs> trying to hide it from everybody because because have you have you noticed when Billy when, and Sally no because um, no because anytime we have we, to the end of the they went to the Bermuda Triangle for a while yeah, no and they definitely and, disappeared yeah and I will say this anytime when 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 Billy and Sally's friends want to come and and, and have a weekly outing. And anytime Sally's not there, Billy's not there either. And Billy and Sally are coming from the same location. Did anybody follow Billy and Sally's uh, social media to like? Hey, see? I'm, I'm gonna keep it a band with Bill, Billy and Sally's social media. Like, I follow them, but I'm not checking. Like, no. Now got, I'm about to start being nosy. I got, I got, I got, well, no, you don't need to be nosy because, you know, because, because we're all friends and Billy and Sally, they, they go and they, they blow up the freaking group chat or unnecessary stuff. <laughs> and why would Billy and Sally do that? Unless Billy and Sally got something going on. And that's all I was saying about Billy and Sally. So, but it's all right because you know what? We, we we like Gene, and that's all that matters. Yeah, that's funny. Hi. 
Fuck Gene and all them niggas you talking about. I don't know them niggas. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just boy. He's like, the name is. Oh, it's yeah. closed. I'm going to drop a bomb. Oh. By the end of this podcast, y'all going to know who uh, <laughs> nobody <laughs> is. <laughs> How how Billy Seven met is. Sally. We're, we're about to start a new movie. Hey, Billy and Sally. <laughs> Featuring Gene. <laughs> but anyway, speaking about, you know, make, make believe stories as, you know, African American content creators. Well, mostly uh, okay. smooth. So, you know Content creators. Yeah. I, I, I said it all officially. Um <clears throat> so pretty much I was going through some stuff and I noticed yeah. that I was and that's actually it was weird. CNN um Took took um brought it to my attention. MSN brought it to my attention, which is I thought was really interesting because usually only outlets from you know that target different certain demographics would report things like this. But this, so I guess it's big enough that you know other outlets, mainstream outlets, they had a um they had to go in. Care now, they care now. Yeah, well, not care now because I'm not sure if they care now. They had to report it. Um, pretty much black content creators, they're, um, they're kind of fed up with, uh, with TikTok and they are leaving the platform. So there are, there is, a, there's one called fan base and one's called clapper and they're kind of being promoted as the black TikTok. So as fellow content creators, as you, um, you guys are, so especially smooth. And especially to clapper. Hmm? I gotta get I gotta get home and smooth on clapper. Yeah. That's all I'm here. Yeah. No, so <laughs> so 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 pretty much as what do you guys think about that? Because you guys are both content creators. I would ask Celine, but she just put me on mute and then she froze herself, which means she went on the other line because she doesn't like us anymore. So um, um oh now she's back. But so I'll start with smooth. What, I took a screenshot and sent it to somebody because they asked to call me, but I told them that I was in a meeting. Oh no, it's it's okay. all good. Hey. No, so actually, so um so first of all, I know Smooth does. Celine, do you do you use TikTok at all? I mean yeah. I'm mean, in any store. I, I have content. I mean I have TikTok, right? Mm-hmm. And I have content on there, but I'm not on there like just know what's happening if that makes sense like all right what about you kev i have quite a few few, few videos man i don't use no damn tickety talking all right so um I do watch it, bro. well i I'll guess I'll, I'll start with 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 you smooth um have you ever have you seen any resistance on tiktok um some you ain't uh, asked non, me that non-growth so, <laughs> compared to so, other platforms so, so so listen uh, to keep it a band right I think got really boring and I wonder why. <laughs> so if all the black creators left, I understand how it got boring real quick. Cause yeah. they had nobody to copy. Cause I was like, where'd all these dances go? Dances go. Where There's, the where the where the, where the where the flavor go? Where the style go? Where the soul go? Oh it all left. Left. Well, Man, that shit ain't gonna be work. Creators. They're gonna be yeah. they're gonna no be one to copy. The when they ain't got nobody to copy, they dances look lame. I it started that. with um, Megan Thee Stallion's uh, hands on my knees, shaking ass on my thought shit. Bro, that was so embarrassing, bro. They they was doing this. Mm. Yeah, I was like, what? <laughs> well, no, because are in the song. Mm. The girl, the girl was like, the girl was like, the directions are literally in the song. Hands on my knees, shaking ass on my thought shit. And they were walking backwards and back and forth, like waving their hands in the sky, not even following like what. Alan, what's the backlash of? I'm gonna tell you something, man. Well, they no, had it, their little it, asses what, back on. Well, right. That? Well, that, that's why I was asking smooth because I'm saying, as a content creator, have you noticed any struggles on pretty much to try to promote yourself or have any growth on TikTok compared to, compared to other platforms? Um. Oh. Oh. That's the question. Fuck. I didn't answer that at all. Um, so listen, to be very direct and answer your question. Um, yeah, like you'll notice it, you'll notice it, like even, even on other platforms, but on TikTok it's per- persuasive, per- pervasive. Is that the word? Yeah, I think I'm saying Make it sure right. you put your uh, turtleneck on when you speak like that. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> TikTok on, especially. Seminar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think, um. Smooth yeah, dates. It, it, 
<laughs> Yo, let's not bring that back. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> yeah. So it is. It is very hard for black creators. It just is inherently because the mass just wants to see white people do the same thing the black person did. On it. Well, and I'm gonna go on that and and in right. something else no it's not, it's not kev's turn real fast it's, it's what about celine celine ha, i just have, got a hot take for you man because what that nigga just i mean excuse my language yeah, y'all what that yeah, man yeah. just said Go they want to see listen they want to see niggas do stupid shit and then they didn't want to see the white people do the stupid shit after the niggas but no one gets hurt that's what they want to see. Well, no, well, we're, we're that's why they doing this crate challenge. No, we're, we're we're gonna go on that. What about what about hey, you, crate, Celine? Crate for, challenge for, is hilarious. So, on your content, so because I know you kind of don't exclusively make content for TikTok, but um, do you have like similar content on on your multiple platforms? Me? Yes. Oh, uh, I mean, I just do like pictures for the most part. Or like promotional videos. Yeah, but but, but do you use those promotional videos? I don't videos? have any like dance videos. No, no, but you got no nigga TikTok. No, I don't. I, I'm saying it doesn't matter what you do. Oh, I'm yeah. saying is your content similar on TikTok as your other platforms? Yeah. Like. So if you put a if you put a promotional video on TikTok, do you put the same promotional video on Instagram or YouTube? No. Are, 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 I don't have are a YouTube, similar? but um, I mean, actually, I do, but I don't use it. But um, I mean, TikTok is videos; yep. it's not well, no, because no, because <clears throat> Instagram's going to reels too. So, okay, so pretty much, yeah. The point, but reels, I don't like. I don't like putting videos on my page. Okay, I just like. I mean, well, the reels I feel like it's just for pictures. You know, the reels don't and, have to go on your page, right? <laughs> yeah, I know, but I'm just saying. Like, I feel like TikTok is for TikTok. And Instagram is for Instagram. Amen. I don't like that they try to like. I mean, I understand integrating, you know, kind of like Instagram is starting to remind me of Facebook now. If that makes They're sense, owned by They're owned by the same company. Yeah, Facebook. Bought I know, them. but I'm just saying, like, the those way are two operate. different social media platforms, though. So I'm just saying, Instagram is starting to remind me of being on Facebook, like, right. If yeah, that makes probably sense. Got the same I, I used to get on Instagram just to be on Instagram, not to be on the same thing as another platform. Well, if that makes sense. Well, yeah. I, I get what you're saying, but what if I told you that they integrate other features because they want you to stay on their social media platform? See, that don't work for me. But it works for other people. And then I want to get. It's to like I rather go if I want. Like it. It actually. I've noticed like I'm not even on Instagram as much as far as like I mean I post content just because like to get my algorithms up and I'm trying to get more followers so um obviously you have to post content like every day and get clicks and you know whatever so I have to post but do I stay on there mm -hmm. and like just scroll no like unless I'm looking for something specific like a nail design or you know, like ingredients for something. I kind of use it like Pinterest in a sense. Mm. I guess that's another way to integrate it, I guess. But I don't really like using it. I don't like really scrolling too much anymore unless I'm actually like, it's unless it's for a purpose or a reason. Mm. I mean, a, a lot of people, I think they get tied into, I don't know, like TikTok. I'd rather go on TikTok and look at videos versus be on Instagram looking at. So what videos. you're saying for our fans, there is no naked TikTok, correct? No. What? You never, you never heard of that? We got some fans asking if you got a naked TikTok. Just tell them no. What? Who? Kev just be Kev. I'm anyway, just fucking messing around. So, I, I was so lost, bro. Okay, God, hey, so, hey, you you think I'd be kidding though? That's actually okay. Crazy. So, but that's the thing too. But move on. No, but, but no, but 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 like you said, you rather scroll through videos, and that's that's the reason why. And Instagram knew that, which is why they got videos so people scroll through their videos. But back to the main point on on topic is that, <clears throat> and it's kind of what yeah, I'm, it's, I'm it's, high, y'all. So I yeah. just I knew it. I fucking knew it. I knew what I saw up in there. Just talking. I know what I saw. <laughs> no. Listen, hey, I got this sense up here. It's a pothead sense. 
so pretty much to piggyback off of Kev's point of what he said is he should have just let Kev no Kev said his point he said it <laughs> he was direct to the point I, I was just asking you was about it? because I think Smooth kind of alluded to it you went around it and <laughs> did, 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 it, did, it, did it get it <clears throat> so I'm, I'll just say it kind of to what, what Kev's point Kev is saying that pretty much People do not want to see black people do something. They rather see the black person do it and the white and the white person um and then the white person do it, right? I'm not sure what people they are, but black black creators are feeling suppressed by the Instagram, not Instagram, the TikTok, not even algorithm, just the TikTok. Um, I guess for lack of a better word, censorship. I'll do you one better, bro. I could definitely see. Look that. at look at who gets paid from TikTok. Who gets paid from TikTok? Sin Ray. A lot oh, look, of girl dance. Sit on yeah. national television. Collected a check. Didn't even credit the girl. That's so what are, what are the black creators uh, suggesting? Like, they, they think the algorithm... Basically, no, they want no, credit so, for no, so, their creation. So, no, so, so, the, oh. so, the, so the black creators, what, what they're noticing is that... Cause, and I, I can say one thing, too, because that's why I was asking Smooth, because Smooth puts up... He puts up shorts on YouTube, and he, and he puts up videos on TikTok. And then he probably mm -hmm. does a real on Instagram. And that's why I was asking him, like, hey, what is your reach on each platform? Do you get more traction on YouTube? Do you get more traction on Instagram? Do you get more traction well, on you TikTok? You my reach, too? Huh? Me the reach oh, too. Man. No, because black creators are noticing is that if they put a video on Instagram and they put a video on TikTok, to their TikTok for some reason will have like very very minimal views, but it will take off on Instagram. Oh yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah no, 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 that is a fact. It will take off on. But Instagram. it it, it will take really off depends YouTube, because it's not Instagram it's not going to take off on. At the same way, sounds like they got a fucked up algorithm. No, and no, and and that's why no, and that's why I'm saying that the algorithm is they're saying it's suppressing black creators because another thing too is that they will put out a video, and um and it will get shadow banned, it will get taken off because of terms of service. Too. Oh wow! But someone someone would would go will go and duet their um their that so use the same audio from their video, and so everything's the same except the picture on it, and it's fine. Yeah, I could definitely see how people would feel like uh, the, the way that they're feeling, like their videos are getting shadow banned and yeah. pushed below. And I and then and then TikTok is saying that there is no such thing as a shadow ban, but they're they're noticing that the, um that it's true. And I know um because yeah. there was a guy on TikTok that I actually follow. His name is like Jason Banks. Um, okay. so it's like it's like it's Jason Banks, and he uh. You know, so so he so he has videos. Some of his videos were getting taken down, but there's another individual that kind of uses his audio from his videos and makes their own videos because he has a series called like with Derek because he's like Derek's his son, and mm -hmm. he's like scolding a son or Derek's doing like silly things. So the videos with him because it's his, his he's in it. It will get shadow banned. It will get taken down for violating terms of service. The people that go and parrot his videos and use it because it's audio and it's audio or they'll do it with it. Their videos mm -hmm. their videos stay on the platform. So and, they use and his comes. audio but not his original video. Well, content. that that are are are, are they'll do it. So anything that they say, hey, you're violating terms of service. You know, and so and you're like, what's so what's violating terms of service? Is it the content of that in the audio? Obviously, it's not that. So the only thing that's different is. The person's face. Actually, I think I read a case similar to this. Um, mm -hmm. Somebody was using copyrighted music and did a voiceover similar to what you were saying. Mm -hmm. um, I think in that case, it was determined that like it wasn't like a court case, but mm -hmm. the fucking audio track that they were recording over, mm -hmm. which was just the original recording with someone recording over it, it was found not to be in TOS. Yeah. So like you, the original content creator, like if you uploaded a fucking um, what, what what do you call it when you sing by yourself with the piano, like a solo, or whatever? Mm -hmm. You upload sure. a solo with some copyrighted shit, you can get your shit striked. But if someone did an upload of you doing that to the copyrighted shit, I don't think mm -hmm. they necessarily get. It yeah, no, but th this wasn't it. But, but 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 that's the thing. But it was it's it's Jason Banks. He does, he does his own comedy, and that thing. So okay. it's its own routine, and they they were taking his stuff down. Yeah, see, and who. Yeah, go ahead. I'm sorry. Oh no, so and 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 he's not the only one. That's just the one that I've noticed that I've seen, and and yeah. and he he's brought up. And there's other 
there's there's other creators that that, that done it like um so you know so so then there, there's Conley, um so Conley's one that that you know he, uh, that he had an issue of uh, Charles Conley, um mm -hmm. he he had an issue of it too, and then it was you know. And the thing is too is that they'll they'll make them take down the content, but if people go and kind of cyberbully them and call them the edit warden and stuff like that, they will keep yeah. that up. None of that will go. None of that will go ahead and violate terms of service. But um, but that's the thing. But but then you know, and and that's what that, that's what we're talking about. So it's it's either the terms of service and their banning techniques. So I guess their censorship, for like a better word, is taking them down. Yeah. Or if someone goes and reports them and they say, hey, your profile is banned because of this. Um, I they, bet it's more the first one. Yeah, kind kind of like KJ I mean, Gatello band on on Facebook, the with, same thing. But see, that's see now. What do people describe as a fucking shadow ban though? Because a shadow ban, like thinking from a technical sense, is when you are I wouldn't even say banned. You're restricted. Either you're like yeah. on a blacklist, whitelist. You but you have no way of knowing. That exactly. You are. No, and 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 that's why they're saying that you have no way of knowing. But then it's kind of like the same thing. If if say yeah. you get shadow banned, right? And you put the, so so you post a video doesn't get any traction so you're like okay yeah. and why it's not go, why it's not going anywhere I post the same video and then it, it hits the, it hits the algorithm that's how you can show hey someone's getting shadow banned yep so yeah. a lot of different tricks and shit yeah. uh but know, yeah that, yeah that's I say the stuff. algorithm definitely sounds screwed. Oh, yeah. Like it sounds like the, the algorithm the algorithm is inherently racist. I mean it, it just is what it is. Like people. People don't really like they like the select well, few black people. They that's really what it is. They like a select few black people. I if couldn't you fit the demographic. If you fit yeah, the de there's demographic no way that I of the, over those 10K. black people, of those people, and then they they won't watch you. I'm be honest. I don't. I don't know like how. I I don't know. Just I don't think they would program the algorithm to necessarily be racist, but it probably is picking like, like if you got. The black folks doing the black dances and shit that we do that drives the culture, right? It may not get as much traction, but the moment they fucking have that algorithm picked up, oh, this little white suburban girl is doing the fucking crank status and shit. The goddamn algorithm probably goes. Well, I will down. say that Twitter had a, had an issue with propping their photos, and they had the same issue where depending on because 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 you know a twitter the photo's small first before you click on it right. well if a white person was in the photo it would it would perfectly place them every wow. single time when Fucking it was a black shit. person it wasn't yeah. doing that and they actually outreach to that too so i'm not sure if they're using a similar algorithm and even instagram has had had its share this is of, like moving someone in the picture like centering them yeah it's, it's kind of like a thumbnail because it, it, it does like an auto thumbnail and it, like you know and it was like 90 percent of the time if it was a white person it would be right if it's yeah. a black person it, it it was always wrong so then so then you can't see it so like pretty much if i'm taking a picture of myself you know if i was white the thumbnail will be here, right? But then, mm. if it's if, if I'm black, it will say, "Hey, it will focus like on the freaking shield." So then, if you wow. look at the thumbnail, like you don't see me, you just you just like you just see the shield. They need to fix whatever the fuck is detecting their colors. Well, <laughs> that, no, that's what I said. They, they fix it with Twitter, and I mean, and even Instagram hasn't had much. Um, it's not above its controversy as well either, too. Yeah. Um, so, but I don't know how they could explain this one. The TikTok, like I don't know, well, like, they probably more... don't even know why black. People well, it's it's you have to think about the, it's the people the people in control because like like you said because you said hey they if if you want a certain people to to get the recognition certain people to do that because now like I said because he said with, with Allison Ray people are able to use TikTok now go into the mainstream and start a whole new career for them too, so it's like what people do you want yeah. to do that. Yeah. And and like like Smooth said, they like if they like certain black people, it's the people that are already famous. If they don't want any, if, if they don't want any new homegrown stars like Celine coming out here and and, and being mm -hmm. and being like the next Allison Ray, that's that's what they'll do to to prevent to prevent that. I mean, th these are only theories. Nothing's been um unfounded, but that's how that's how creators are are feeling. And no, I could I could definitely see why people feel like that. Um, so, it just. I don't know. That couldn't be one person behind it, like you're saying. Well, you it's, it. it's a collective, but yeah, but, yeah, but and then Definitely. but that's but that's like for like for Celine's question, it's like why why does Instagram have it? Instagram has it as an outlet, and the thing is because unfortunately TikTok has like what like sixty million sixty six million users in, in the U S alone, in the U S mm -hmm. alone. So mostly children. Yeah. So Probably. so it sucks because hey, the people they're they're, they're being forced to leave a platform users. 66 million users in the U.S. alone. Mm -hmm. 
It's a long no. TikTok is huge. It's yeah. a huge app. Crazy. Yeah. So so the, I so, wouldn't even get mm-hmm. oh, go ahead. No, I just wouldn't even throw it in the same boat as like other social media apps like Instagram and, and stuff, man. TikTok is like I'll I'll say TikTok this. TikTok is like if you oh, were rapping, TikTok was not made yeah, with but, us in mind. It wasn't made with us in mind. Cause you gotta look at it. Was no, 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 no. Let me let me let me fully expound on that. So like you, you gotta look at like Asian culture, they they pride themselves on like the fair skinned Asians. Like you move those up in the up hey, in you, you social speaking stature, something dangerous. Like, My Asian home is gonna come get me. No, 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 but for real, for real niggas. though. For real though, that's a real thing. They literally put makeup on themselves to make themselves lighter. Like it's a yeah, real thing. Yeah, that's like some older shit though. No, that's what they used to do. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Do it though. They still do. It still happens. Not not the younger generation, bro. They trying to be more like us nowadays. And no, like they still have, they still we have get, that fair skin of, thing. Like that's still a societal thing. Though. Japanese, we get a lot that's of Japanese. Because when you when you look at how the you look at how the indigenous people that's are treated, indigenous people are are darker skinned. Bad. They yeah. literally called a very specific name. I forget what it is. Like I was watching a thing. Yeah, I mean that that's. Bro, like, yeah, having darker skin is kind They of... even treat people different whether you're in the city or you live in the rural area. I think historically, if you had darker skin, like, around the whole fucking world, people are kind of likely to treat you bad. Stuff in areas. Where... So, so to, to round my point home back to TikTok, yeah. TikTok, they made it, you know what I'm saying? Like, um, it's Chinese app, correct? Yeah, it was originally Chinese. And Chinese, Chinese culture is still kind of like that way. Japan isn't as much that way no more. I'm not really talking about Japan, but I'm talking about China. China's culture is still that way as far as like the people that made the app, like of that age, like that made the app. Their culture is still that way. Like or in how they view things is still a little skewed, you know what I'm saying, towards like fair skinned. Mm-hmm. So when they built the algorithm, it was for their own people. And their own people were fair skinned. So that's why... Like okay, so that's it. They were more supportive thing. because they're already fair skinned. I don't we know how you could intended to even be on there. I'm gonna be rude to you. I don't know yeah. how you could program an algorithm to like, like if you're talking about like colors in the photos example that Alan gave, I can definitely see that. But like, I don't know, on a video sharing site, I don't know what I would hashtag on black black. So I, I would rather, say, I don't know, I'd rather say somebody might be in control. I of think, the algorithm, you know, like the spotlight area. Well, no, I, I think algorithms are learned by by behavior. You, and I think that's the algorithm because you're saying like e- even with the pictures, if it's doing this, it took it took them to go in there to go say, hey, let's fix this to to go ahead and do it. But the problem right. is, it, it, it took them to a tipping point to fix Twitter's issue, and even Instagram yeah. had certain issues like that too. And even this algorithm, like any algorithm, it is learned. Um, yeah. So, so I don't know if TikTok is a hundred percent algorithm, like. I'm, I think you were on to something where you were talking about, like, you know, who controls it. They can put certain uh, influencers right in your face, you know, if they wanted to, even though they got the algorithm. Mm. But, um, but yeah, but that, that's Celine's point. That's why. So people like back back to what I was saying, TikTok, 66 million users wide. It's hard for them to leave that business. So that's why they yeah. they go to freaking Instagram because Instagram is it's the closest it's the closest one with a base anywhere that size. And even though maybe only 50% of the people even click on the reels tab, you know, mm-hmm. if we go to like Instagram users, you know, in the U S alone, cause I said, if, and you get half of that, you know, 33 million, that's still better than nothing. Cause the problem is the, the new platforms that they're using like clapper and fan base, mm-hmm. you know, it's like one's like 1.5 million people. So you're going from yeah, 66 bro. million to one in the U S alone to 1.5 worldwide. Those apps are going to die quicker than fucking Clubhouse, man. I'm I mean, it, it it depends. I mean, it, Club, I mean, Clubhouse is such an atrocity on how it, they died. It depends on like how are they, how are they engaging the user with their content. I think TikTok is really just a piggyback off a of fucking Vine. TikTok used to be Musically, which it was is. one of Vine. It is TikTok used to be Musically, which was literally a direct competitor to Vine around the time. All musically, the Vine Triller, like all yeah. all of them. Mm. All of- when it, when Twitter acts fucking um, Vine, I think people saw an opportunity there. 
I, I think that was a bad decision on their end to fucking act. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they they could have just they actually understood how popping that shit was. Vine would have been what TikTok is now, in my opinion. Yeah, Vine yeah. and TikTok Easy. was literally the same exact thing. It's they just two different on- names. Vine to where you could make a little bit longer videos, it would have been a wrap. And then TikTok has ways you engage kids or just people who like having fun into the app. They got all these dance challenges and stuff, and you literally go on there and do the dance like it's playing a game on the Wii Mm -hmm. or some shit. You get your little points or whatever. Like just that whole thing gets people playing it too, especially a lot of fucking kids. I could definitely see that. Yeah. Oh, say. Oh, yeah. Okay, so and you're so. No, I'm watching a. I was watching a fight video thread just a second ago. Man, it was it was absurd. We were getting beat. Okay, so well, pretty, is... pretty much, but yeah, Instagram has 70 million users, so which is why so the reels are are, are going to take off. But those other platforms, I don't see them dying because <laughs> if they're marketed as an alternative and they'll get their fit their fan base and they're less yeah. they're, they're they're less regulated too. That's to help people until they get to a point where they are too too big, and then they get yeah. regulated. So so people people they'll like it for that too. Because I mean, like if you look at look at Discord, freaking look at Instagram, you know. Of, of of how it started and then you know a small startup dude every time i've seen people like jump off of one dominant app to another app it is never made back. another app to dominant app mm-hmm. back like, to the dominant app you know, myspace to facebook but see the thing is was okay i think that's a little different facebook, facebook is for family and friends like well, but in well, the beginning it was just about originally to say that. started well facebook originally started just for college students yeah. you had to have a that's college true. edu and i think this is similar to what clubhouse was trying to do there's like right. that kind of exclusivity window there like, oh yeah. only a college student get in oh only people with invite get in they get build the fucking user base up build I made big money enough and then they invite. fucking open it up I don't think Facebook necessarily like was Facebook really competing with MySpace for that long of a time. It no, because like I, I think Facebook's Facebook's opening was just when it when it opened, it was astronomical. Because I think the thing was yeah. too is part of the allure with Facebook is in the beginning it was so exclusive. So then when they opened it up and other people could get it, it's kind of like oh, right. I have to have a freaking Facebook, you know? Yep. And then that's and then and then I the, the same thing I can say about Facebook, it, it has evolved. Over yeah. and over and over again too, which kind of, which kind of helps it for the for the dominance. But I think it was because it was MySpace and and Facebook, and yeah, they did different things in the same space, but they were mm-hmm. so they were so competitors. It was too many niggas trying to hustle their mixtape on MySpace for it to succeed. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I, I miss I miss the um. You remember everybody back in the day on the MySpace used to put producer or or musician or art. Everybody used to put all that shit. Man. Everybody was dropping mixtapes. Yeah, I, mean, I got on. Yeah, MySpace. I remember LimeWire. Yep, LimeWire yeah. was lit. Um, good old LimeWire. Open, open that you don't get a virus. You like this? Please, no virus, no virus, <laughs> no, no virus, for real, no virus, no virus. <laughs> Okay, well, I think we beat that one, so... Uh Uh-oh, I can't hear smooth. Oh, I can hear him. Oh, he was cutting out, but then then, then he just came back in. There's that doo-doo internet in the gone. My internet, (laughs) boo-boo. So... I guess besides that, you know, you got these, you got these new apps, you know, Clapper and Fanbase. People, they are calling Clapper the black TikTok. So, oh, Clapper. Yo, why okay. they gotta call hey, that shit Clapper? Hey, why, why, why they, why they, um, why they, why oh, over shit. this woman, man? What? Tripping over her, like, what's up, what's up with that? Like, who they, they just found her body, the FBI, like, confirmed, like, it's really her, but, like, Gabby, um, Gabby, what, Gabby, Petito. Petito. Oh. Yeah. Um, is it... okay. Hey man, I'm reading some up about Clapper. And Clapper always... is the uh, Clapper is the fucking alternative. They tried to tell people after the January 6th riot to get off. <laughs> Since they were getting shut down. 
<laughs> or I don't know if they were getting shut down. They said they were. They ain't banned for that far right shit. They told the far right people to go to Clapper. It's a free speech alternative to TikTok. Oh shit. Yeah, I don't know. I said. Oh, well, 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 I, don't I don't know. We'll what see are, what. What, the, are the, what are the apps are there? How far did free speech uh, go? Probably people say it all types of in hard R's and well, all that. Well, no, I think with Clapper it was different, and and now since it's saying this was five days ago, so now I think that <laughs> if, they finally got the no racism thing yeah. in the TOS. <laughs> So, so we'll, oh, we'll, we'll definitely see. Hey, we're getting we're getting followers. We're getting hey, if Clapper do it, they make it moves. Right after the Capitol riots, a free speech alternative to your favorite whatever without the bullshit. Oh man! Oh, come on! Black man. people don't like TikTok. We finna change it up. <laughs> P.S. No racism, no nothing. We support fucking black creators. BLM. Oh man. Yeah. Please, please come over here and make us money. <laughs> oh, that's what a lot of these companies were doing. When they were doing that Somebody video. Please, bro, over here smack my ass with a pillow. If I'm falling asleep. Smack you with a pillow. Oh, she's falling asleep. Okay. Uh, oh, yo, she said this. Hey, you said you had a confession. Talk about something else. Celine, what you want to talk about? I want to talk about Celine's confession that she says she had. A confession. I changed my mind. What? Typical woman. I don't want to confess. You're taking the car back. I'll take my um, what is it? I'll take my Marys and my Josephs later. Okay. What about your Billy and your Sally? You get yeah, your Billy and Sally. You know how they be doing it at the Catholic Church? Hell no, I do not know. I was just I was just in a Catholic church when I was in San Francisco. That much you know from the movies. Bro, I went to Catholic Church one day with uh, my I, ex, like, I lit a and candle. that shit seemed like a cult. That you, shit. You, you didn't do the confessional? Man. Confess. You, there was nobody in there to confess to. Like, and I didn't uh, find, yeah. I didn't I didn't know what the confessional thing was. Normally, it's like out there, but it wasn't. I forgot like, what it was. was. Mm-hmm. They had everybody drinking I from think, the I don't, cup. I think it was what I Murphy. Got going uh, on. What do you want? All right, Alan, what's the next subject, bro? Got to get this show rolling. I was. I can't be the only nigga pulling the carriage. Get your ass up here, boy. <laughs> ah. Smooth well, your ass we next. tried to squeeze in Gabby, but then somebody decided. I tried to, I tried to segue to Gabby, but nobody bit. Nobody bit. Well, oh, no, you did. And, and, and then, and then Kev talked about Clapper. Oh. So talk about, talk about Gabby. Go ahead, Smooth. Oh, okay, so listen, man. That, look, my heart's out to a family condolences and all that stuff i i gotta say that up front okay like nobody's family deserves what what just happened to her she didn't deserve what happened to her nobody deserves to be murdered just just off rip that's all you gotta say that off rip that's my pc answer however you hear this type of stuff for black people there was 75 and 75 no 76 excuse me um indigenous people like we're talking Native Americans that died in Wyoming, like, no missing in Wyoming, not a peep, not a peep from the local media, none of that, not a peep, no news not coverage, a, none of that. Who? It's because I really do think her following had a lot to do with why it's so. You get know what I'm saying? It's such a thing because obviously, like, if people that know her know like how much she posts or that she hasn't been responding and it's the fact that her boyfriend came back without her and she went with him and he's back and she's not he's alive and now they found her dead like you know does this sound like um csi miami spoiler alert the boyfriend probably killed gabby i'm just gonna keep i'm pretty sure of it i was gonna say that like we we all do you Bro, this is not the station. first time. There's, this is not the first time some shit like this happened. Like, how does he leave the police station? He probably wasn't un- under question as a suspect yet. Oh, no, no, my but, okay. Not at that time. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. Fine, 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 fine. Yo, is y'all left the house, went on a trip together, posted the video on social media that y'all went together. The police can see the video. Mm-hmm that man leave without explaining how 
not get back here with you? Because you can't legally just fucking, I mean, back in the old days you could. But nowadays people got rights and stuff, you know? Yeah, that and they probably could have said, you know, and he could have gave him some lame ass excuse. Could have gave him some cool ass alibi that gave him enough time before they started treating him like a suspect. And that's why his ass is missing right now. Because he knows. If he was black, that wouldn't be the case, bro. He would have been under the jail. Oh, no, man. How, oh, bro? I think it's easy to say that, but, bro, like, even in other cases. No, 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 cases, no. I'm saying yeah. keep everything equal. He's a white guy. White woman. Black man. Missing white woman. You was the best person with her on video? Bro, you did yeah. The black guy would have been in jail. Clear, man, under. Suffering you a little bit. You know, I'd say that is that's how history is treated us in the United States of America. But I can't say for certain on 100% of these cases. I mean, I think I would have got away with it. I'm just telling you, I'm OJ. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's not, let's not. It was bad. As long as the glove does not fit, you know. <laughs> OJ's son. <laughs> OJ's son killed them, killed them people. It was the water hose that killed them people. It was like, Colonel Mustard. It. What, 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 it was just that. It was Colonel you Mustard know, with the candlestick in the billiard room, okay? Hey, they got caught by the boogeyman. That's what it was. It was Candyman. Every black kid know about the boogeyman. It was Candyman. Mm. We shouldn't have said that. Oh, buggy. I don't Yo, think that, I don't think that pe- people still that fucked up over OJ killing his wife. People shouldn't be. God damn Bro, it. OJ just had to come out and say he 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 wasn't uh Chloe Kardashian's uh father. <laughs> he mm. was that ain't my baby. Like <laughs> OJ been on the drugs, man. Oh man. Juice has been on the juice. Juice has been on the juice. <laughs> That's why that nigga robbed that gas station. <laughs> No, I'm that shit ain't funny, bro. But god damn, if you OJ you have money. Juice man. You famous NFL. What like nigga, what? You robbing you robbing liquor stores or a fucking gas station. Hey. Damn, man. He, In high school, he was the man, homie. Because he, he he didn't freaking invest his money right, because that's what we were talking about earlier, you know. Man. People don't people don't do, don't do right by their money. And then they used a lifestyle. I wonder what the pendulum was like. People were probably, man, you hear OJ? What talking about? That nigga done went off the rails. He done killed his white wife. Talking about OJ Gabby did Tito's. what? And, and pretty OJ much, and, and they were saying, and Smooth was saying that if it was a a white woman and a black guy, I mean, it yeah. would be different. And then Kevin was like, yo, if it was me and a white woman, I'd be like, OJ, freaking, <laughs> you know, because, <laughs> man, they, they, they'd have to acquit me. So well, now we're yeah, talking about I'm... OJ. No, I'm kidding, bro. Love doesn't fit. Don't do nothing. You must have quit. Yeah. Man, everybody know that one boyfriend or fiance did something to her. How's it be? Get a juice, man. Listen, bro, he's going to get called dead or alive with that type of coverage on him. Um, I mean, like I said, um, that it, it does open the dichotomy because if you're saying if it was two black people, um, would it matter? If it was, you know, a black person, a white person, would it matter? Even if it was a, maybe if, I don't know. If if it was a black woman and, and a white man, w- would it matter? But I, mm-hmm. um, and I mean, you could put it to what was uh oh crap, I forgot her name. It was in Northern California. Um, Scott was it uh was it was it Lacey Peterman? Nope, I don't know. Um, it was a California. What they do? Yeah, yeah, you, you, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll buy you some time. So while he's looking that up, man, listen, listen, y'all like, comment, and subscribe, okay? You know what I'm saying? If you made it to this point in the video, man, subscribe, you know, we we chilling. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Bam. Lacey Peterson. There we go. Uh, um, That's his name? No, Lacey Peterson was a, a it was a similar case where uh, a person went and her case, her case was uh, highly, highly publicized. Um, and it was a white woman, and then you know she was um found to, to be killed by her white husband, and but that went for a while too. So it it seems similar sim- similar things, and but I guess he had a better alibi for it, and they had they had to go and and find things about it too. So so 
my thing is like there's a word for this. It's called missing white woman syndrome. It's a real thing. Nigga. What? <laughs> no, no, I, no, I'm literally no. I, I don't, don't know what kind of pseudoscience it is. You need to put your mic closer to you, Smooth. No, did y'all not hear me? Yeah, you need to put your mic closer to you. Oh, what? Listen, it's called missing white woman syndrome. Bro, it's a real fucking term. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, shit. I'm not kidding you. This is a social scientist. Yeah. So this is what got Emmett Till killed. Well, no, she wasn't missing. Oh, no. She was just mad a nigga whistled at her. Yes. Wow, man, I'm looking at this shit. I think yeah, you need to put it in front of you so, like, like, you, like you it, thought I had a hot take and I was capping. <laughs> no, nah, nigga, I looked it up because I was like, I gotta see if what he's talking about is real. No, nah, I mean, I could believe it. Um, yo, oh, so you saying Kevin if, uh, looks this... up everything? Yeah, you gotta know. He's a producer. That's about. his job. So you saying, Mister? You saying, um, if it was a case where Gabby was white woman and they had a black man. That missing white woman syndrome would kick in. That nigga would be locked up within 24 hours. Yes, bro. Listen, they not playing. I can't. Bro, I can't even, necessarily even say I disagree. Look at, that, look at the no, no, no. Look at the number of resources he got. Right. Yeah. That's crazy. Cause, cause when you look at black woman goes missing, nothing. Yeah. Goes missing. Nothing, I mean, they do. Not a they peep. do got. They do compare. Goes missing, missing. Nothing. Not a peep. It makes some comparisons between thing. like people with missing white woman syndrome, MWS as we we'll call it. Well, cause and then like they were comparing that to like coverage of missing children from like black folks. Like had, black um one of my, my best wings friends stop. in elementary school, his sister went missing. Yeah, they, they say never um, found they perceived her dead. They never found her body or anything. Shit. In Peru, Nebraska, Nebraska, Peru, Peru, well, Nebraska, whatever. Uh, I know someone was was missing out here, which was really really sad because she um, pretty much she was at a restaurant on PCH, um, left her wallet, looked like she was like kind of on something, so and then they freaking arrested her, um, took her to like a police outpost, and then they kind of let her go because she was fine, but but when they took her, um, and they let her go that night, they, they didn't take her back to her car. So they kind of let her walk on PCH. So then she was just found, you know, missing. And they're like, okay, where did you, you know, did you, did you let anybody know? And they kind of just let her go and, and they let her walk off into darkness. And they let her walk off in the darkness and killed again. her ass and act like they lost, let her walk off. Well, no, the, the, the thing is, you, you see all that. So you let her, they let her walk in the freaking darkness. But it was like, hey, like where, where she was arrested from or taken, or I can't say arrested, where she was taken into custody from. And then where they let her go was like ten miles away, too. And then they, they didn't give her a ride back to, you know. So no, you, you actually see it. Let her go. So I'm that they you see you see her let her go. So so if you're videos saying, stop, hmm, videos can stop. No, okay. But I'm saying on that one, I'm saying you can see it though, because if you have multiple, so with that one, I understand what you're trying to say. But if you're trying to get a conspiracy of three different organizations to do that with the government, and I know, and Smooth and I know the government, they can't coordinate their own damn shit between the CIA and the FBI. There's some stuff like they just can't do. Okay. So, <laughs> so if you're saying that gross, that, gross negligence. Yeah. No, it no. I'm saying it was gross because I'm pretty much saying if it was a white woman. They would have made sure she got back to her car. But the thing is, too, which is what we're okay, saying. Not negligence, it, gross incompetence. There you go. Um, but but what we're saying, too, it's the fact that, unfortunately, if, if we put it into, you know, missing white, white woman syndrome, whatever, whatever we want to call it, it's more based upon the fact of freaking resources. Unfortunately, the people with resources are able to go and say, hey, this person's missing. And the people that, you know, don't have the resources, unfortunately, that people don't know, so they don't give a damn. You just get stuck at the police station going, please, have you heard anything? Have you found anything about my baby? No, we haven't found anything because we don't care, okay? Yeah, no, because, yeah, but that's the main, because it's, it's how much resources you're, you're, you're able to gather. And the thing is, too, unfortunately, some of these people, because of their, and I might even say about the race, because of their social social class, mm-hmm. you know, and right. and, 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 that, right. and that's, that's, and that's what I'm saying. Listen, like, bro. Hmm? When Gabby went missing, 
I bet her whole neighborhood had all tons of flyers. Have you seen me? They got milk cartons. And you know, shit, and that's man. what I'm saying. It, but it's resources yeah. they could because they have resources. They have they have a platform they could use. Unfortunately, a lot of minority people, you know, they don't have that platform, and it's easy. I for, still ain't never seen a missing wanted picture for a black kid on the back of a milk carton. Well, I haven't seen any missing things on the back of a milk carton, but I've, 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 I've seen them at the post office and stuff. No, but that's the thing. But if it's on there, that's like the worst place to go because no one's freaking looking at that too. So, yeah. but, but 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 that's what I mean because no, because I I've seen missing stuff on flyers on stuff around the neighborhood like that too. But when you have resources, it's on the freaking news. Mm-hmm. And I, and I'm and I mean that's that's just the issue because unfortunately, and I think it goes back to the to that last panel panel that we're on. You know, when you have the resource to do it because of the social class, you're I mean, you're able to do something about it. And unfortunately, we're handicapped by the social class. But and, and that's what we're talking about, where it's like we need to teach our kids to go op- open, open their horizons. So then so after that, they, now, now they have the resources, because because right now we talked about it before, too. And I remember that's where Prime and I disagreed. He's like, oh, he's, he's like, kids don't only go to school for this and this and that, too. And I'm like, yeah, I'm sorry. My mom's a teacher. And a lot of minorities, that's what they're going to school for. <laughs> yeah. You know, because they're going for, for, for the next place j- just to get by so they can do something, so they can get by and do something. They don't even like school. They don't even know what the fuck school really is for. Well, no, because they say it's not, because it's already in grand firm that it's not good enough for them. But then, unfortunately, the cycle is now that when it's their time and their child's missing, too, mm-hmm. they're in the same position. So they now, so then they can't, they can't get those resources that other people, other people are afforded. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. okay. Y'all two look like y'all are about to pass out. Yeah. I Ooh. literally just said about ten to fifteen minutes ago. I'm literally falling asleep. All right. Well, that will end this episode of Homeroom with Smooth. It is twelve you know, twenty a.m. Where I'm at. We're in yeah. it. Well, we got Celine about to fall asleep. If we want to, mm-hmm. you, you y'all could join can us. Continue, but you, I ain't gonna lie. Bro. I'm about to be. I can put myself on mute and I just close my her. eyes. Like this twinkle listen, in her eyes. I like Celine, be, listen. If I was shutting that, the door, we gonna, we, gonna have, we gonna have Alan rap. This nigga is about to pass out. Look at him. Have Alan Dude. rap, bro. Well, you Dude, like, bro, I, I am exhausted. You like, so, nah, I know. That's why I'm rapping right now. <laughs> so, so what's this? Exhausted. So yeah, so this thank you for joining this, this, this episode of Homeroom with Smooth. Um, thank you for listening. If you if you got this far in the video, like, comment, subscribe, leave a comment. Let us know what you want to hear us talk about. You know, we're gonna do some of these, some of this more. Just you know, I'll just say shooting the shit. Excuse my language, but you know, just yeah. talking around roundtable discussions. That's what we'll call them. We'll have more of these roundtable discussions. Coming. You know, Rose and hopefully session. you guys could join us. Want to know how many boyfriends I have? So hey, listen. They still waiting for big, that uh, big, naked big TikTok plug. No, so I was like, we Celine, can plug it out to them. No, you, you know what we're gonna do? We're, we're gonna have a one-on-one interview with Celine coming up. So Celine, she'll 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 tell yeah. about all her fans. So we'll ask some questions. We'll have that up on the channel. Hey, do not know when yet, but we'll look forward for that. So you know, Celine, two hundred dollars a click. We still gotta do. We still gotta do the the live thing, the IG live thing. I don't know what, what is we're that? doing. But yeah, but yeah. Yeah. so yeah, thank, you, thank you for joining we us. We rotate the people like for dates, a date oh. with Celine. Okay, we might have to do that. We'll see, but that'll be part of the okay. inter- we have to do the interview first to get yeah. people interested. So mm, other okay. than that, yeah, like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. We are out.